Okay, multiplication division. No problem. Okay, no problem with multiplication division. Bakit? Do the normal operation. Okay, by the way, ha, it is assumed that you know your basic math. Okay, your grade, your grade one, grades one, two, three, na math. Okay, you know how to add, subtract, multiply, divide. Okay. Ang problema lang sa integers kapag may signs na um, two unlike two like signs, it's positive. Two unlike signs, it's negative. Okay. Let's go with multiplication. 10 times negative 5. They are not like. Okay? So 10 times 5, that is 50. Since they are unlike, they have negative 50. Ayan. Okay. What about this one? Negative 2 times negative 3. Negative. Okay, very good. That's 6. Kasi pa, pareho sila ng, ano, pareho sila ng signs. What about this one? 3, negative 3 times negative 4 times negative 5. Okay, very good. That's negative 60. Okay. Makikita mo naman yan kung positive or negative kapag yung dami, yung dami ng signs, let's say for example, tatlo yan. So 3 is odd. So therefore, negative, negative, positive times negative, negative pa rin. Okay. Okay, kapag ganyan, um, pwede, pwede, ano, pwede kayong mag-multiply muna ito. Mas madali. That's positive 20. Times negative 3, that's negative 60. Okay. Mas ma um, dito naman, 3 times 4, that's 12. Okay, 12 times 5, um, okay, 60. Pwede din. Then that's negative. Okay. What about this one? 14 divided by negative 2. Okay, good. Negative 7. What about this one? Negative 108. 108 divided by 9. Okay, that's... That is, okay, 12. Negative 12. Very good. Last one. Okay, very good. That's positive 42. Great. Okay. So there's no problem with multiplication and division. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Questions? Questions before we move on? Okay. Okay. Ah, uh, by the way, ah, uh, maisingit ko lang, no? Expo uh, exponents. Exponents. Paano kapag exponents? Pag exponents, 2 raised to 3. Hindi siya 2 times 3, ha? Please, please, please. Marami nagkakamali dyan. It's 2 times 3 daw. No. That is, uh, kapag may exponent, it's the number of, it's the number of, um, ilang beses mo siyang uulitin as factor. So, ito yung base mo. So, 2. Tatlong best mo siyang uulitin. 2 times 2 times 2. And that is 8. Okay, good. Great. Okay. Never. Kasi yung iba, yung iba, ginagawa. Kasi nat, na, pag nakakita na nito, 2 times 2. Ayan. So, kapag ayan, okay, 2 times 2, ayan, 2 times 2, tama naman. Okay, 2 times 2. <laughs> Pero ang ibig sabihin niyan, dalawang beses inulit yung base na 2 as a factor. Okay? So, wag palilin lang ha. wag palilin lang. Okay. Great. Okay, that, so that's exponent. What about this one? No? Negative, um, negative 2 raised to 4. What's the answer? Negative. Mm -hmm. -da -da -da. Negative 2 raised to 4. Negative 2 raised to 4, that is, what's your base? Your base here is negative 2. Okay? So, ibig sabihin yung negative 2, apat na beses siyang uulitin as a factor. So, that is negative 2 times negative 2 times negative 2 times negative 2. Okay? And this is 4. And this is 4, and that is 16. Okay. Kailan lang siya nagiging negative 16? Kailan lang siya nagiging negative 16 kapag nasa labas ang negative? Okay. Halimbawa, ne ayan, negative. Okay. Unless, ang, unless ang sagot mo dun sa ano ay negative. Th that will be positive. Depende pa din. Depende pa din. Let's say, for example, 2 raised to 4. Ayan. Negative 2, uh, negative quantity 2 raised to 4. 2 raised to 4 is 16. Okay, 16. Times negative, that is negative 16. Ayan. Doon pa lang siya nagiging negative. 
Okay. So please, please take note of that. Yung parenthesis, yung nasa loob, please take note of that. Okay? Kung ang negative ay nasa labas o nasa loob. Okay? Now, sige. Example item. <clears throat> Positive 15 plus negative 9. Okay. Positive 15 plus negative 9. That is letter, letter A. Okay. Actually, sino nag-compute? <laughs> sino nag-compute? Okay. Kung makikita natin, kung, kung, kung malaki-laking number yan, medyo matagal yan. Pero kung ito, madaling makikita. Pero isa sa makikita ninyo, positive 15, negative 9, anong gagawin? Minus agad, right? Minus. Hindi yan pwedeng zero. Okay? Ano dapat ang sagot ng ano? Ano dapat ang sagot natin ng, 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 ng total or ng sum? That is positive, right? Kasi mas malaki ang 15. So therefore, letter C, letter D, letter E is not correct. So A and B na lang yung pagpipilian natin. Ayan. Okay. And since negative 9 is, negative 9 is um, kaiba dun sa, sa sign ng 15. So therefore, that is 15 minus 9. And that is the answer is positive 6. Sometimes you don't have to compute everything. Okay. Isang technique yun. You don't have to compute everything. If you know the rule, and if you know the ano, alam mo na agad yung, yung possible na sagot, then you don't have to compute anymore. Na alam mo yung C, D, and E, I, wala, ay hindi tamang sagot. Okay? Based on the rule pa lang. Based on the rule. So therefore, you have now 50-50 chance na, ah, okay, alin ba dito ang tamang sagot? A or B? Ah, okay, it's A. Oh, di ba? Mm -hmm. Yeah.